A tagging study will provide the third and final estimate of red snapper abundance. This study will include stakeholders, such as recreational and commercial fishers, as a critical component of the scientific process. In 2019, 4,000 legal-sized red snapper will be tagged and released across the U.S. Gulf of Mexico immediately prior to the Gulf State's red snapper recreational fishing seasons. To ensure consistency, all red snapper will be tagged by scientists working on the great red snapper count in collaboration with recreational and commercial fishers. Yellow tags with text beginning with RS followed by a unique five-digit ID number will be placed beneath the fish's dorsal fin. Some fish will have two tags, so that tag shedding rates can be estimated. Tags from recaptured fish will be worth $250 per fish. Some double-tagged fish may be worth up to $500. Recreational and commercial fishers can get involved in the tagging study by recapturing tagged fish and then reporting those recaptures by calling the phone number printed on the tags. Upon catching a tagged red snapper, fishers should record the fishing port from which they departed, the date, the fish's length and weight, and the latitude and longitude where the fish was caught. Because the physical tag must be mailed in to claim the reward, fishers should always clip off and save the tag, even if they plan to release the fish. Fishers who report their recapture and return the physical tag to the research team will receive a reward. If a fish has two tags, both tags should be reported and returned. Rewards will be distributed through the end of 2019. Tag returns will be combined with estimates of catch and effort from participating fishers to estimate red snapper abundance. Stay tuned for more videos in the Great Red Snapper Count series to learn more about the project. Questions or comments? Contact the project team at snappercount at heartresearchinstitute.org. For more information, please visit us at snappercount.org.